This is Outdated, and welcome back to the Bonfire Chronicles. Uh, let me apologize for last episode. Uh, for some reason, last episode, and I had an episode of, uh, yeah, I'll get it out here in a second. I had an episode of Enraptured 2 that I had no audio on. I don't know what it is I did wrong, but I did something. So, I have, and while we were away, farmed and cleared out all of this area. Matter of fact, before I forget, let's, um... Let's go ahead and take care of business. I'm gonna head down here. I'm gonna use one of these. All right, humanity's restored. Let's rest here. All right, now I'm gonna show you. So I've cleared out all the enemies through here, like every last one of them. And while I was doing that, I kind of accidentally opened up the secret thing I was trying to open up before so and I think that was the uh, the one with no audio so you're gonna see all the enemies here are gone I can drop down here now the pursuer has been popping up here I have not actually taken him out I haven't messed with him I honestly don't plan to until I'm through this so over here there had been a crack right here up top here, there had been a barrel with one of those big... Ooh, treasure I can't get yet. With one of those big dudes standing here. And he usually kicks it down, but I never could get him to kick it down where I wanted him to. So I just farmed this area until I killed everything. Then I came up here, and as I was walking back, I was going to actually do this in the video, I accidentally bumped into the barrel, and it rolled and hit the wall and blew up. So we're going to go ahead and see what's in there first. Ah, Excellent. A bonfire. This will make the commute a lot easier. Alright, now what do we have in here? Lots of chests. Let's talk to him first. I think he might be blind. Mm. Mm. We've got a wild one here. Shape up. Shape up, I say. Oh, <laughs> that's it, yes. That's the way. Dear flame, how brightly you burn. <laughs> See, right now his forge isn't even set up. I ought to fetch a new ember. Yeah, I'm thinking that too. Flame, dear flame. I ought to fetch flame. Okay, let's just go ahead and open these chests. Flame. Titanite shards, five of them. Nice. Large Titanite shards, two of them, nice. Ten iron arrows. And... Ten heavy bolts. Okay, now that we've interacted with him some, he should actually create his, um... It's locked, crap. He should actually get up and start making this into a, um actual working blacksmith. So let's find out. Let's do a quick travel to Majula and then we'll travel back and see if that worked. Okay, we're here. Now let's travel back. To the blacksmith. So if you saw last episode, there were a lot of different things to do here. Let's see, is he up and about? No, he's still not up and about. I may have to beat the boss for him to be up and about. And that's okay, because that's what we're about to go do. So let's go ahead and move forward. So there was the old uh, barrel. Alright, 
right now. You're going to see right over here, and I don't know if I got to mention this or not. There's a doorway there. There's actually a door that's closed. It's kind of like a fast travel. I don't say it. it's like a shortcut, it, but it's a shortcut that you know you only use if you don't mind dying. But I'm going to go ahead and open that for you so you can see where. But I've cleared all these guys out. So we've got some serious ruin setting on us to get to. Ooh, hey. Okay, I didn't realize I could do this. Let's let's do this. Treasure. Large tonic chart. Okay, excellent. Well, that was all that was there. All right, I'll head back. And I'm pretty sure I cleared out all these guys too. We're going to make sure. Okay. There was one down here. He's gone. All right. We're going to open this. And that's the fast travel thing. You could roll and land in there. Now, I'm not one to mess with that, honestly, but it is available. Okay, now I've got a couple of summoning signs. We're going to go ahead and summon them. Let me make sure these guys are all dead. Oh, yeah. All right, Felicia the Brave. Here we go again, Felicia. Okay, come on, Felicia. And Pilgrim Belclair. So in the last episode we took on this boss twice and basically got spanked both times. We're going to try again. This time I think I'm going to stick close and do a melee until my partners get in there. Then back off. So we're going to give it a shot. Here goes nothing. Oh, he just hit the floor. Well, at least we know what to do. Keep him busy. Crap. Can't hit him when he's up there. Come on. Go to a position where I can hit you. There we go. Come on, Felicia, keep it up. Oh, crap. Ow. All right, that's one down. Here come the other two. That hurt. Now let's keep hitting that one. Come on, Felicia, you can do it. Oh, I missed. Oh, bye, Felicia. Okay, that came out wrong, but I think you guys know what I mean, Felicia. Ouch! I do not like you. You suck. The good news is you're all that's left. It's not hit.
Vamos, vamos, cara. Come on, Pell Pel Claire. Let's do something useful. Almost. Oh, that's it. Come on. One more hit should do it. Goodbye. Did it. Yes. Whew. Victory achieved. Finally. Good job, Pilgrim Bell Claire. Ruined Sentinel Soul. Got it. He just kind of shot over there. All right. Oh, Lord Almighty. Okay. And did he... That's where he threw his shield. That's kind of cool. All right. If I'm not mistaken, there are secret doors in here. Right here, I guess. A ladder up. Why do I think that's not the only secret door? What's this say? Try tongue, but boulder. It's hilarious. All right, um, I feel like there's another one over here before I miss her going up. There it is. Just in case you're a mimic, you're not. Target shield. All right. And I have a feeling there's another one right here. So I think there were a total of four in here, but there might have been more. Wow, that was impressive. Hurrah for pointless. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. What about here? Alright, there's one. Let's see. Rusted coin, okay. Was that it? Let's see. Here's a doorway. I'll deal with that in a minute. Looks like they've pretty much marked them. That one tried to mark one. Lizard wall ahead, but we know that's not that because that's, that's lies. Because we were right through there already. So I'm going to go over here and take that ladder. That should bring me to one of these platforms. Or not. It brings me to a chest. Just make sure it's not a mimic. Not a mimic. What do we have here? The spell Hush. Uh, nice. Illusory wall ahead. Brings me out here. Treasure. Homeward bone. I think there's a way to get over there. So let's head back down. Matter of fact, I'm to the point where I need to get out of here and level up. I've got enough to level up a couple of times. Was it this one? No. This is over here. Nice job, butthole. Oh, you're hilarious. Visions of Dwarf. Try rolling, fatty. Ah. Now we're over here. No, nothing. No. 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 Be wary of enemy. Trap ahead, therefore try prudence. Okay, this is where I need to go. That was the trap. Ah, a bonfire. Nice. Ok, 
Okay, you know what? We're gonna go ahead and use this bonfire. I don't want to lose these souls. So I'm gonna go ahead and travel back to Majula, and we're gonna level up. I don't think I have enough to upgrade my staff, but I really need to upgrade that staff. Let's go take a quick check and see if I... I mean, I need Titanite. Or Twinkly Titanite, I think. Hmm. Okay. Reinforce weapon. Twinkling Kite Knight, yeah. I can't do that at the moment. That's alright, though. Alright. It was worth a try. Let's head over here. Let's talk to her. No, you can tell I have an extra Estus Splash thing. I picked that up uh, while exploring and doing this. I'd come across a chest I'd missed or something. Uh, let's see. So what do I want to do? What's up my intelligence and my faith? That ups my dark bonus by four and it ups a bunch of stuff. Confirm. Yes. And I think I want to try to level up to 30 for each of those. And I think I'll be in good shape there. For now, let's see, is we've got a merchant up here, the one we met in uh, No Man's Wharf. We're gonna see if he can sell something. I trust you kept up your studies. You betcha. Oh, he's got some interesting rings. Increased magic defense, shortened spell casting time. I kinda like that idea. Also, buying more of this stuff isn't a bad idea, either. Um, let's start with the ring. Shorten the spellcasting time. Okay, I've used up all of his... Uh, Spells. You know what? I can get that last ring. I can get that last ring because I've got little souls I've picked up here and there. Let's use one of these. Boom. That should be enough. Back already? Yeah. I want this other ring. Trust me, I'm not. I just bought everything you had, pretty much. All right, let's take a quick look at my inventory. So we've got the Silver Serpent Ring. That gives us more souls. Ring of Blades increases uh, physical damage, I think. Royal Soldier's Ring increases equipment load. We're going to get rid of the Life Ring and use that. All right, give me a second. Okay, I think we're ready to move on. So let's continue and explore. So that was one of the two bosses from this area. There is another one we need to take on called the uh, the Lost Center or the Last Center, something something Center. I can't remember, but either way, we'll do a little more exploring, and I think we'll call this episode. So we can go down. Or go that way. I think we're going to go that way. I want to see if that will open us up to something. Oh, uh, there's the explodey guy. He's right there. Got him. You giving me souls for blowing up? No. Ah, well. It's worth a try. Alright, let's go ahead and see what we can find here. Where does this lead? Oh my. The 
Bastille key, oh god. Oh man, he snuck right up behind me. Oh my lord, I didn't know he was coming. He had some you freak. So annoying. Life gem, okay, let's see. So where does this lead? Move up in a second. I just want to see what's out here. What the? All right, something's about to get ugly. Okay, this is where I need to progress. I'll deal with that in a minute. For now, I'm gonna go up and see what's up there. Which, considering close quarters, I better pull out a weapon, or a sword, or something. Okay, where am I? Oh crap, I remember this. There's dudes in here that will blow up. You gotta watch the explodey guys. Okay, and I think I remember this. Yeah, never made a lick of sense why that was there. Okay, and I think this one opens twice. I think you have to Pull here. Hi, dude. Pull up. Oh, we gotta take these guys out quick or they'll be right on our right on us and taking care of business. Oh, he's about to blow up. And he successfully did. Alright, let's switch to a sword. Gotcha before you blew up. I think these big ones might have one in there, so let's try this. Ow. Get up, get up, get up, get on. See ya. Alright. Okay, mildly annoying, but we got him. Alright, what do we have here? Hurrah for pointless. Yeah, pretty much is. I see you. Let's see what's up here. Oh, I remember. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was a quick way to take care of all those guys. Okay, I get it. Alright, so I can move up. Secret? Yep, get ready. It's probably trouble. say try left and then be wary of tough enemy illusion ahead okay let's grab this green blossom oh crap I already think I know what this is guess who's back the pursuer Ow. 
I do not have the ability to dodge that guy. Oops. Okay, that sucked. <laughs> All right. You know, I think uh, we'll be exploring this area in the next episode, and we'll see what we can do. I'm surprised he popped back. I thought he only returned if you were hollow, and I'm not hollow at the moment. But that is okay. We made some progress. We figured out what was there. I can continue to do some exploring. Actually, you know, let's... um. Yeah, we went that way. That's what we did. We went that way. I don't think I have much of a desire to go after the Pursuer again, honestly. I just don't think that's something I want to do. Pretty sure I went up here. Because there is one thing I do want to do. That is take care of getting those souls back. Where'd that dude go? I just want to get those souls back, so we're going to try it. Oh god. There we go. Die, you moron. There we go. Okay. So this is where the secret was. Can I get in through here? No. This is where the secret was. Where's my soul? Where are my souls? Where are my souls? All right, let's run and grab them. Is he coming back? There he is. And I'm leaving. Sorry, Pursuer. I am not in the mood. Go pursue somebody else. He just disappeared. He's like, screw this, I'm out. Alright, let's see. I feel like there's more here. Good bit we can explore here. What are you? Fast travel? Uh, there's the treasure I saw. I'd have to like do a drop down navigation to make that work. But this looks like it was worth it. Wilted dust curves, okay. Oh god. Alright, come and get me. You're either coming in here or you're not.
All right, we'll just do it like this then. There we go. Whew. There's a part of me that wants to like. I can't see crap. Oh, hello. I think I know what to do here. I'm going to use a Ferris Lockstone. Now we have some light. I also saw an enemy in there. Let's take him out before I mess with these chests. See ya. Alright, let's start with you. No, not you. You. Alright, let's open it. Okay, this episode's going longer than expected, but that's okay. Bone staff. That might be something I can use. Let's take a look over here. Check out you. You good? Twin blade. And let's check out you. No. Parrying daggers, okay. That looks like it, and of course, here. Right, we're good. Soul vessel, okay. So we got a good bit of stuff. So we can go up the ladder. I think we'll do that. I'm just curious what's up here. No idea where I am. Okay, now I know where I am. Ha! Ah, perfect. I know exactly where I am. Awesome. All right, let's head on down to the bonfire. This was exactly what I wanted to do. We're going to rest here. Better safe than sorry, we're going to travel back to Majula. And I think that's going to wrap up this episode. Um, so we took out the Ruin Sentinels. We did a good bit of exploring. We finally took those guys out. But that's one of the things that Dark Souls 2 does give you the ability to do. Is kind of uh, clear out an area. And it makes that a little easier. Um, it's its way. I mean, that's why most consider Dark Souls 2 the easiest of the three games. Um, and also you can tell because this is the first time I've really had trouble with the boss and uh, it did take three or four tries even with like phantom help and stuff so you know I've been like mowing through them relatively simply I mean the pursuer when he pops up randomly I'm not I just not messing with him um, there's no real need to kill him although you can farm him for uh, you know now I think about it it might be twinkling titanite which I could really use so I might try that next time but I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please like and subscribe. And I will see you next time. This has been Outdated. Peace. Out.